What is up, LHS? I'm Brandon, and today I brought out our star basketball player, Nigel Marville, to help me host the TNT Thanksgiving special. What's good, LHS? Thanks for having me here, BVA. I'm excited to be hosting the Thanksgiving special. Same. I'm excited to be hosting as well, but extremely excited for Thanksgiving to actually get here. Word. I can't wait to be in Collard Greens next Thursday. It's the best side. Collard Greens is good, but definitely not the best Thanksgiving side. So, for our first segment, we sent our crew out so we can see what the best side dish really is. Let's find out. Good morning, everybody. It's Mr. Caputo. I like to say my favorite sides are cranberry and uh, stuffing, turkey stuffing. I think they're really good, delicious. Enjoy Thanksgiving. My favorite is jam, no weight, stuffing. Stuffing is the best. Gotta have veggies on Thanksgiving. So grandma taught me that you gotta have something that makes you thick with youth. So it's parsnips and huh? herbs. Put gravy on top of that, you're talking all set. I love vegetables, but my absolute favorite is stuffing. Yes! Mac and cheese. I'd have to say it's sweet potatoes. Uh, cranberries go hard. Cranberry be busted. <laughs> all right, what would you guys say your favorite Thanksgiving side is? Oh, this is a good one. Yo, you tell them first, bro. My favorite side is beer skins. It is mashed potatoes. My favorite Thanksgiving side is collard greens and macaroni and cheese. And mine is macaroni and cheese and candy and cheese. Uh, mashed potatoes, cherry pie, big mac and cheese. Mashed potatoes with butter on it, homemade and them. No, it's gotta be mac and cheese. Well, all right, all right. Yams, yams are French fries. What? I gotta agree with Miss Bass. Gotta be that mashed potatoes. See, there you go, Josh. <laughs> exactly, exactly. That would absolutely be candied yams. Candied yams with the marshmallows on top. No, no, that's the best. That's weird because I'll be honest with you. He, uh, Coach Corsell just stole my answer. I did not. Because I love candied yams with. You with said canned with, yams. With a nice crispy marshmallow. The mini marshmallow. Yes, a small. You one. said canned yams, not candied. I had stole, it. Stole that answer for the record. Best side, hands down. So, yep. enjoy your Thanksgiving day. Yeah, happy Thanksgiving. Collard greens definitely didn't get enough love, I think. Hey, man, at least you could show them some love next Thursday. That's true. Now for our next clip, we're going to be looking at some of the cooking talents of LHS. What did they make? Members of the TNT News crew made fried apples and stuffing and burn them for a taste test. Bet. Let's see how it went. Roll it. Happy Thanksgiving, LHS. My name is Gabriel Gonzalez, and today we're going to be making some delicious stuffing. And for stuffing, we're going to be needing 18 to 24 ounces of cut bread cubes, one cup of unsalted butter, one cup of diced sweet onions, two cups of diced celery, six teaspoons of minced garlic, three tablespoons of sage, parsley, and rosemary, two and a half cups of chicken broth and two large eggs. And to assist me in cooking, I will be having my lovely mother. <laughs> Hi, LHS. So, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Then, you're gonna wanna coat your baking pan with butter or olive oil. And then, with your bread, you're gonna have to cut it into cube-like pieces and put it in a large mixing bowl. Then, take your butter and you put it on the skillet. Now that your butter is fully melted, you're first going to want to put in your onions. Then you're going to want to put your rosemary, parsley, and sage. After a minute, you're going to put your chicken stock. Then we're going to put one and a half cup of chicken broth. Now that you've popped it in the oven, you can let that sit there for about 40 to 50 minutes. For now, we're going to take it to the TNT studio for a little taste testing. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Happy Thanksgiving, LHS. 
What's up, LHS? I'm Vontae. I'm Chris. And today, we're here to try a nice Thanksgiving feast made by our friend, Chris. So we got some stuffing, and we got some fried apples. You want to go first and taste, or you want me to? Uh, I'll go first and see what it tastes like. Alright. Mmm. That was a pretty good, big piece, I see. Bro, Looks this pretty is good, though. really good. Yeah, let's give mm. it a shot. This is delicious. Yo, bro, we want to try to fry apple fish. I don't All know. Right. Yo, okay. bro, Vontae, we're going to have to switch. That stuff that smells incredible. Okay, okay. Ooh. Try some, try some. Come on. Yo, Brendan, try these fried apples. Nah, I don't know about that, but this stuffing. Okay. Uh huh. Ooh. Big piece of everything. How's it taste, bro? Mmm. Incredible. You want to try the fried apples too? No, I'll try the fried apples. I'll try it. How's the fried apples? Oh, they're not that good. <laughs> I love fried apples, and these are amazing. They're not that good to me. You're missing out. No. I just can't stop eating. Jeez. I'm stuck in my fur. Mm. Wow, I thought those fried apples looked really good. If you say so, but that stuffing is really where it was at. Now for our next segment, we asked LHS what they thought about Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Bro, Black Friday is way better, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, I agree. I'm all for the Black Friday madness. Let's roll the clip. What do you think is better, Black Friday or Cyber Monday? Black Friday. Why? Oh, because sometimes, like, if you go online, it's easier. Cause, but if you go in person, it'd be too heavy. Just like, I'd rather online them. Cyber Monday. Why? I don't feel like getting up. I think that Black Friday is better because you get to go shopping. If you were to ask my opinion, I think that we're asking the wrong question here. I don't think I could buy anything on uh, Black Friday or get any deal on Cyber Monday that would be more important than the memories of family and friends on the Thursday of Thanksgiving. Probably Cyber Monday. I think there's more deals. Yeah, definitely Cyber Monday because Black Friday is just too chaotic for me. Um, I saw on her work some like retail Cyber Monday, 100%. Okay. Uh, is Black Friday worth waiting for? Yeah. Because I don't feel like paying a full price either. Yeah, maybe have some good deals. Thank you. Not really. No. no. You can get deals off this website every day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's a lot of deals everywhere. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. No problem. I really like Miss Monte Allegra's answer. She's such a cool person. I've never met her before, but that was a really nice answer. For our last segment, we're going to get all sweet and sincere and we're asking LHS what they're thankful for. I am most thankful for my two boys, um, oh. Anthony that's two and Michael that is five. What are you thankful for? I'm thankful for my friends. I'm thankful for my family and my friends. Uh, same thing, thankful for my family and friends and good health. Um, what I'm thankful for is for my family as my as they're really close to me, and I appreciate them every day. I'm thankful for my family too, education, God, just everything really. So I'm thankful for my family, I'm thankful for friends, and just life in general. Uh, I'm thankful for the New York Knicks, you feel me? I'm thankful for my family and my friends. Uh, I gotta say, I'm also thankful for my family and friends, and you know, Chicago Bulls, it's our season, it's our season, what? I'm just thankful for my family. My grandma. Well, I'm thankful for my whole family. I'm thankful for my whole family and to be here in the school. I'm thankful for my friends and family. I'm thankful for Melody no, uh, blocking our space. Right Thank you. My name is Melody Zang and, 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 and I have this message. And Nike. And, and Nike, by the way, just do it. Miles Great. for president. Hey, Nigel, what are you thankful for? Man, I'm thankful for a lot of things, but I'm probably most thankful for our cheerleaders for what they do for our team. Shout out to them. Yeah, they're awesome. And on that note, we'll be wrapping up our show. Thanks for watching us. Just hope you enjoyed the episode. Remember, you can watch all our episodes on our TNT website. And make sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram for updates and behind the scenes shots. 
Everybody make sure to wear your IDs and masks when you're in school. Have a great week. And have a happy Thanksgiving, LHS.